Hi, I'm Steve Teresi, Director of Training and Technical Services here at JL Audio. I want to share with you some great information about one of the best system amplifiers you'll find for the marine application. It's our M800-8V2 system amplifier. Some of the things that I think are really great about this amplifier is the fact that every aspect of it is great for the marine environment. Everything from the input sections, which are specifically designed to get rid of any noises that are likely to happen on a boat, to the way the inputs actually work. There's a wide range of voltages that you could use, so any source signal that you may want to drive into it, it can accept. Additionally, there's several ways to turn the amplifier on in case you don't have a turn-on lead from your signal source, like if you're using your iPhone or iPod device, it doesn't have a turn-on. This has uh, ways of turning on just by detecting a signal, which is really kind of neat. When it comes to the actual function of the amplifier, as you go through it, you'll notice there's several different inputs. This one has eight discrete inputs, so you can run eight separate channels of audio into the amplifier. You could also just use two, four, or even six channels of input if you wanted to. The amp can be configured to allow for all of that. Some of the applications of it, that one is pretty obvious, it's an eight-channel amplifier. You can drive eight speakers with it. Some things that I really enjoy is the fact that I can now have a, a really big four-channel amplifier. I could bridge each pair of channels into a four-ohm speaker and basically get four by 200, which is a really powerful uh, amplifier for pretty much any size boat. Another configuration that I think is really kind of special is very often in a boat you'll have uh, tower speakers that go across the beam of the boat. and Those are used to project sound behind the, the boat as it's moving for wakeboarding or you know, water skiing or whatever. Those often need additional power. So what you can do is you can actually use this amplifier, bridge some of the channels to the tower speakers for additional power, and use the remaining channel for speakers that are on the inside of the boat for the people that are in the boat. Additionally, you can use the HDRLC to, to control the amplifier. And what I love about this is you can do zones with it. And what that means is you can use the HDRLC to, to control two, four, or all eight channels of the amplifier. You can control the whole amplifier with a volume control. So if you're using, again, your iPod or something like that, you have a volume control capability that controls everything. Or if you just want to control the zone for the front of the boat or the rear or the tower speakers, you have full flexibility using the 800-8. The best part about it is the fact that it's so compact, so powerful, all the connections are on one side, making it really easy. And the connections are ABYC compliant compression terminals. And in normal terms, what that means is the way the fitting is, is done is very good for the marine environment. It prevents corrosion and makes sure you get a nice uh, tight connection on the wire. So if you have an application on your boat that you're looking for multiple channels of uh, amplification, the 800-8 is an excellent option for you.